behind me, soldiers and tanks guarding the Opera House, where just a matter of days ago, in a hail of bullets and dead bodies, Romania's bloody revolution began. And just a few days after that, the hated Ceausescu was dead. Opera Square here has been renamed Liberty Square. But Timisoara in Western Romania still fears retaliation from Ceausescu's security hitmen. Security and vigilance is everywhere. They have good reason. Timisoara's dead, the price of their resistance to the old regime remains an unknown figure. We have now to start a new life. This is it. A much better life. We have all, all hopes. We are full of hopes. All our hopes to restart our economy, to have a better future for our children. So it's liberty mixed with sadness, a very great sadness. All day, every day, people light candles to the dead. But there's real hope for Romania's future. The new Democratic Front for National Salvation fights hard to feed its beleaguered people. In the army, so crucial to the change of power, there's transparent relief. All is beautiful, <laughs> but I don't know to tell you exactly, but all is beautiful. Everywhere now, spontaneous debate from a people facing into their first free elections. And as Romania celebrated the new year, joy at a totally unexpected new decade. It's unbelievable. <laughs> it's unbelievable. <laughs> 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 <laughs>